friends welcome back to my channel today I have some unboxings for you so only one of them is a bookish box but I thought it'd be fun to do all of them because I always love seeing what's in these boxes so let's do the bookish box first this is book of the month I actually haven't gotten book of the month for a little while but I was super excited for a couple of the picks that they had um, lately this uh, exact blade is like, I better be careful. But I was super excited for this book, which is Anxious People by Frederick Bachman. Frederick wrote Bear Town, A Man Called Ove. I'm trying to think if there was one more, but I love them. So I'm super excited to read this book. I actually did get a copy through Libro FM through their ALC program too. So I'm super excited I can kind of piggyback both listening to the audiobook and reading the physical copy. And I just, I have a feeling I'm totally going to love this. And I always love bookmarks. Does anybody else like have this super hard time with like losing all your bookmarks or all occasionally have to go and pull them out of reads because I just leave them in there when I'm done. Let's see what is next. Oh, so next is Fab Bit Fun, which I don't think you can see anything, but let's open this puppy up and see what's in here. Sorry, I'm trying to use natural light because I have my glasses on, so I don't have like the best setup um, to display these, but here we go. Oh, can't throw more tape. More tape, more tape. Okay. So, here we go. This is what it looks like so far. Not super interesting yet. Um, okay. So we have the book. This um, has like random articles in it, I think, but then it also has like spoilers, so I definitely don't want to look at it yet. Um, then we just have some random geez, cards here on top. Um, what is this one? $80 off of HelloFresh. I've done, I don't think I've done HelloFresh, but, um, Olivia from Olivia Reads a Latte has been doing them, and I'm kind of interested in doing them again when I have a little bit more time at night. Um, Bright Sellers and Gather, oh, pass this on to a friend. So if somebody needs or would like to try FabFitFun, I can link it below, but here's $15 off. Okay. So let's just go with the first thing I see. This says it's hydration. Oh, it's like a mason jar. It's from the company Mason Tops. Let's not break it before we get it open. Oh, look at that. So it's like a, a cloth silicone sleeve on a glass mason jar with a cute lid. This is super cute. I have way too many water bottles, but I love them. So this is super cute. I like this a lot. And hopefully with the sleeve on it, I wouldn't break it because, you know, <laughs> I've been known to break things. But yeah, super cute. Definitely don't want my kid to use this because it's so cute. So definitely keeping this one to myself. Uh, next, what do I see? This is a pore cleansing clay mask. I love clay masks. I actually am in need of one right now, so perfect timing for a little pampering tonight. Um, let's see here. Uh, finish cream. Shape and moisturize. So apply to damp or dry hair. Let's see. Oh, it's got a thingy on it. Mmm, it smells good, just really fresh. I tend to wear my hair, um, like, air-dried, so this might be nice to put on when I do that. See what it does. So, I'm kind of sad because I picked out a bag in here, and it's definitely not in the box. So, apparently, I didn't get the customizations, I mean, which I didn't really know that that happened, so that's sad. Um, what is this? Okay, let's see here. Oh, 
it's like travel cutlery. That's nice. I do tend to, um, you know, eat out or eat lunch at work. So it would be nice to have cutlery with that is mine. I know it's clean. Um, and then I'm not wasting any other plastic. Sustainably crafted cutlery and it's by the brand Hip. So, and matches my, kind of matches my water bottle. Okay. What is in here? I'm really sad. I was like super, like one of the reasons I wanted the box was that backpack. So not getting in, I'm, I'm pretty sad about it. Um, this is a necklace that's really, um, looks a little tangled, but it's just a simple pendant, I think. It's got like, um, which I'm glad they kept it nice, but it's really hard to get it off. It's called, by Jenny Bird. It's just a silver pendant. It's cute. I would wear it nice and simple. Um, crease release. So this is like a wrinkle release. So ironing release spray. Definitely not super excited about this, but I do tend not to iron anything. So maybe I should be using it. I mean, it smells good. It smells like laundry, but definitely something I didn't really need in my life. Um, the next thing is glow milk, illuminating milk for face and body. And look at how cute this packaging is. So cute. And this is Tranquility Sleep Mist. Formulated with powerful ingredients to soothe your skin and help you relax. So I think you probably, what do you spray this on your pillow? Oh. I don't really know how you use this. Nor can I get into it. Hello? Seriously bummed about that backpack. Mist around your pillows and sheets to create a calming environment. It smells like the typical lavender-ish situation. So definitely something I would use throw that in the bed and then the last thing in here is another styling cream or so this one's a styling cream and this one's a finishing cream so this one says apply to damp hair for s natural smooth curls or blow dry for a straight shiny look and apply to dry or damp hair definitely more products than I normally use but I guess we can try them out so I wanted to see the book sometimes tells you like if you like what your customizations would be all members get to pick from categories one to three so I had originally what I had picked was this bag and what I got were these styling creams, which is hard to see who it's white on white. So definitely out of everything on this page, that was like the thing I would have least wanted. Um, and then, let's see. I got the necklace off of this page, which is fine. I mean, none of the rest of it I needed. Um, off of this page, I got the water bottle and the cutlery, so that was fine. Huh. So yeah, I guess I'm just, I'm okay. I mean, I have struggled because I've gotten FabFitFun a few times and like wiped one or two products out of it. And I really like this backpack and that was like the main reason that I got FabFitFun. Oh, was this just super cute backpack I saw in one of their ads? Uh, it was a hundred dollar. Um, it was like a hundred dollar retail price, and then the box cost me thirty nine because I also had a code when I ordered. So yeah, definitely sad. But some of the stuff is good. 
if I won't use it, then I'll probably just gift it to a friend. But definitely sad about that. I don't really know why my customization didn't work because I went in there and picked it. So sad. Let's have a drink of bush apple to make me feel better. Okay. Then the last box I have is Stitch Fix. So let's see. I occasionally get Stitch Fixes. Stitch Fixes. Um, just trying to get me out of my comfort zone when I get some new stuff and hoping to like like most of the box so I get a better deal. If you haven't done Stitch Fix before, they actually like send you a mailer so you can return everything. So you get to try it out in the comfort of your own home. So let's see, let's just bring it down here maybe, sorry, I don't have the best angle for this. So let's see here, ooh, this is a cardigan, I am loving this, it's super light and nice, and this color is fun, I think it'll be fun for my with my hair and for the um, fall season. Next is, is this another cardigan, ooh, this is another cardigan. I wear cardigans a lot. Um, I like to layer because I get cold a lot at work. So it's nice to layer when it's still kind of warm outside. Um, ooh, and then this pretty tank that I think I could wear it under either of them really. So I really like that. And then a, ooh, this is pretty. Just a shirt for work. Most of these are obviously work clothes. And then finally, a pair of pants from level nine. And they're just standard brown trousers. They've got a zip pocket. So yeah, I'll have to try this stuff on, but I, actually, I like everything in the box. The pants are probably my least favorite. And honestly, it's just because I really want some more black pants. Because I do have another pair of navy. But it gets me out of my comfort zone for wanting like black and gray. So, yeah, I'm actually really happy with that. I'm super excited about the cardigan. I think tomorrow, if everything fits well, I'll want to wear both of these together because that's super cute. But yeah, <laughs> that is my unboxing for you. Um, honestly, I think I probably am going to be done with FabFitFun because I just feel like I've been disappointed the last few times I've done it. And sad. I am trying to do Stitch Fit like more like seasonally or like twice a year just because it gets expensive but anyway I hope you enjoyed unboxings I always like seeing what people get in the mail I would love it if you guys stick around and become part of the Priory remember to always be kinder than necessary and I'll see you in the next video